Cisco. Hmm. Well, yeah, well, I just got an all-caps text from Robbie about my so-called antics tonight. So it looks like I'll be meeting with a legal team. Again. Uh, as soon as he reads the article you're gonna write, guaranteed promotion. So, creepy mask, guys. What's your take? Just another night in the city. What's your take? I feel like there's a bigger story there. Let's not make this all about business. How's how's it going with you? Did did you get that promotion? No, but we're on the cusp of something really big. You know Oscorp would hire you in a heartbeat, right? One phone call to hair. Sure, but Dr. Octavius' work will help millions. I'm, I'm, I'm right where I want to be, right where I should be. Almost sounds like it's more important than your other job. I've never heard you talk like that before. A lot can change in six months. Why did you ask me here, Pete? You know, just, uh, just dinner between friends. Friends? Is that what we are? Well, maybe we could be, you know, if, if that's what you wanted. There's a lot of baggage here. Yeah, sure, but is that so bad? I mean, baggage can carry good things, too, like, uh, like money and uh, keys and raspberry lip balm. Do you remember why we broke up? This is a trick question, isn't it? Saved by the siren. Talk to you later. Go. Cool. Love seeing you two together again. You always were my favorites. Hey, it's me. What's with the units heading down third? Looks like our old friend Herman Schultz is at it again. Shocker. Didn't he just get paroled? Yeah, well, I guess it didn't take. No worries. Herman's just a big cupcake. I'll have him back in Rikers by bedtime. Just had dinner with my ex after saving her from masked criminals. And now I'm gonna go beat up a maniac who uses shockwaves to rob people. What a perfectly normal life you have, Peter Parker. Sorry about that. Peter, I just want to make sure you haven't left any equipment you've built for your friend around the lab. It's no bother to me, but if the Grand Committee stops by again... Don't worry, Doc. I make a point not to leave anything there. But I know my friend appreciates you looking out for him. There's a lot of people who don't like him very much. That buffoon Jameson and his audience of sheep, please. The people who do great things in this world are those who don't let bullies like him stand in their way. People like us. You said a mouthful, Doc. Take care. All units, report of a break-in. Reported location is in the vicinity of Nomad. Robbery in progress. Suspects are armed. Officers needed in Gramercy. Please copy.
Goodbye, Herman. Seriously? Give it up! You're never gonna catch me! That's what you said last time. I don't wanna hurt you! You'll just pull me down! Wow, that's considerate. What's the money for, Herman? What do you care? Actually, I don't. Just trying to make for my conversation. I'm done talking. But this could be so much more rewarding if we connected on an emotional level. Wait, I forgot. You don't have emotions. Come on, Herman. At least talk to me so we can make it interesting. Herman? What? Do you only answer to Shocker now? Mr. Shocker? Just stealing for yourself. You must be working with someone. Or for someone. You can tell me who it is now, or make me punch it out of you later. Your choice. You know what, Herman? You have like zero personality. But your suit is awesome. Can we talk design details? Maybe later. 